skincare items. So I placed a, no, I'm not going to say it's small. I placed a average style order with old to the order a few items. So I came in today to, came today to do a haul with y'all, share with y'all what I got. And maybe y'all have tried some of these items and can give me a quick review on them. Let me know how I like them. If not, maybe I can give y'all a quick review on them. Let you know how I like them, how they do for me. But that's enough chit chat. Let's get into this old haul. Should have opened about before the video, but oh well. All right, first thing I got is a Z palette, Ulta brand Z palette, to put some of my um, loose eyeshadows and blushes in to get them out of the packaging that they're in, and also so that I can see them in order to use them because they're not getting any use sitting in my drawer in a little pack. So I'm thinking if I put them in here and I can see them, I'll use them. This was $10. I'm gonna try to tell you the price for some items if I can think of it off my head. If not, I'll link everything down below, all right? Need some skincare items. I've been hearing about The Ordinary and how great their brand is, how great some of their cleansers and items is. So I got the Squalene Cleanser. I heard it's good. It makes your makeup just melt right off your face. So I'll just be using this when I have makeup on and need to get it off my face. <laughs> but I hear it's good for your skin and good for getting the makeup off without leaving a trace behind. So The Ordinary Squalene Cleanser. I got The Ordinary niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1% percent high um, This is a serum and it proclaims to um, shrink your pores. And I have big pores in my skin. So it says it shrinks your pores and evens, I think it evens skin tone as well. So I'm going to give this a try. I will let you know what I think of it. We'll see. If these poor craters get shrunken. I got the Ordinary Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. Um, Because I need a toner. <laughs> After I wash my face. I have been using the Sunday Riley, I think it's marshmallow and bentonite clay toner that I had got as an add-on with my Ipsy bag. But I like it. I'm going to finish up using it, but I just want to try something else. I don't see myself buying it Sunday Riley, so I want to try this. And plus, this is reasonably priced. Nothing from the ordinary brand that I've seen has been over $10. And this is what it looks like. It comes with a little... Also, this is what a toner looks like. And it comes with a dropper. And I, I'm going backwards. I know, but I just want to show y'all what the product itself looks like inside the box. Here's the squalene cleanser. Cleanser. That's that. All right, moving right along. I got two two Nyx um finishing spray, setting sprays. I got the matte finish, and I got the dewy finish. The top. Okay. The matte and dewy finish. The setting spray, y'all already know what that is, but yeah, got that. And for cleanser for my face, um, tea tree. I don't know if any y'all know, but tea tree oil was great for blemishes on your skin. So I got tea tree um, by the body shop. It's tea tree skin clearing facial wash. And it's with purifying tea tree oil from the foothills of Mount Kenya. I got the big size instead of getting the little one because I said whenever we open back up to travel, I can fill my travel size bottle up and have this to travel with. And plus, this is enough where I won't have to repurchase for a while too. So yeah, got that. Got two 
two mascaras, mascaras from L'Oreal. I got the Voluminous Original in the color Black Noir. Trying to find the perfect mascara. And I got the Voluminous Lash Paradise, which is waterproof in Black Noir. Noir is black, but black too. And these were buy one, get one half off. The L'Oreal products. And I've been hearing so much good things about this. Clinique Take the Day Off Cleansing Balm. So I got a small travel size of it to give it a try. I'm just hoping because I want to see the consistency. It's a balm. But um, yeah, I got a travel size of it to give it a try to see if I would like it. They said this is pretty good. Your makeup melts off with this as well. You know, give it a try. Like I said, that was the uh, trap size. I got an e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer with hydrating and squalene. So, but um, yeah, I told you I got pores the size of craters. So we're going to give this a try and see if I like this. I picked up two real technique sponges. Um, I've never tried a beauty blender, but I like these. People say they're comparable to the beauty blenders, so I got some extra ones. Yeah. And I got another sponge by e.l.f. It's the Total Face Sponge. I've heard good things about it, so I decided to try this one as well. I just got one of these to give it a try. I picked up another toner. This is the Thayer's Facial Toner with Witch Hazel in the scent Rose Petal. I've heard good things about this too. Um, it's sealed. I can't smell it. But um, I just got. Oh, I can't smell it. The Rose Petal scent came through the came through the seal. But um, it's in the scent Rose Petal, and I just got a travel size. Like I said, just to try it out, and also. <laughs> When we open back up to really travel, I could take this with me. I got a Tree Hut Sugar Lips Lip Scrub because you should really scrub your lips every few days or at least once a week, especially if you wear matte lipsticks or things of that nature so it doesn't look so flaky and pilly. Um, so I got a lip scrub from Tree Hut. Just to keep my lips from peeling all the time. I got a concealer from Morphe in 3.25. I already have 3.55, so I wanted to go a little bit lighter for more highlights. So I got 3.25. Let's see how light we got. Mm, okay. And I can use it as highlight. So it's 3.25. I've heard good things about the Morphe highlight, um, Morphe concealers. I hadn't, I didn't even use one I already have yet, but I was kind of waiting on this one to see which one will work best for me. So I can't wait to give this a try. Let's see, two more items. I got picked up two lippy pencils from ColourPop. Two ColourPop Lily lippy pencils. The first one I picked up is Bichette. It's not Bichette. 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 <laughs> Excuse me. It's Bichette. B I C H E T T. The T. I mean, yeah, the T is missing by the C. But anyway, Bichette. Didn't mean it curse. And here is Bichette. It's a pretty color. Like a crimson red, and I got BFF two. I've heard great things about BFF two, so I decided to get me one and um, see what it's all about. It's just a nice brown. Got a great that's BFF two over there. Look great with new lipsticks. Um, and I believe these were six dollars a piece. Don't get me wrong, like I said, I'll link everything down below. So that is my Ulta haul. That's all I picked up mostly skincare items because you know I like to keep the skin looking as youthful as possible. Um, so yeah, 
that's all I picked up. And as I try things out and get some sort of opinion or review on them, I will come back and let y'all know. And until next time, bye YouTube. Make sure also y'all like, comment, and hit the subscribe button. Be my friend. See how fun I am. Country girls love to have fun. Bye.